Well, that crazy bastard didn't really give us any information that really got us anywhere. So I'm gonna go cut down some more trees. That one looks hostile. Hello, Grand Oak. Oh, are we gonna talk? No? Oh, I'll have to kill this one though. Now maybe everybody's a little more receptive to conversation. What manner of beast be thee that comes before this elder tree? You're not going to attack me, are you? Ah, thou speakest of the others, how filled they are with hate. I apologize on their behalf. They cannot control their fate. Allow me a moment to welcome thee. I am called the Grand Oak, sometimes the Elder Tree. The world is certainly full of marvelous, unexpected creations. Each day we see something that we never thought possible. Wow. And unless thou thinkst it far too soon, might I ask of thee a boon? Why do you speak in rhymes? I do not know. Why dost thou not? Thy words seem plain, a mundane lot. Perhaps a poet's soul's in me. Does that make me a poet? <laughs> hey, poetry. Yes, I get it. It was but a simple jest, a jibe to entertain my guest. What's this boon you mentioned? I have but one desire to solve a matter very dire. As I slept one early morn, a thief did come and steal an acorn. And you want it back, I take it? All I have is my being, my seed. Without it, I am alone indeed. I cannot go and seek it out. Yet I shall die if left without. I could look for this acorn. What's in it for me? My wooden skin has some magic, see? And part of it I can give to thee. And what good will you would do me? The forest would see thee as a tree. And so, no harm would come to me. That sounds like a fine reward. Wilt thou then perform the task? Wilt thou save me as I ask? Very well. I'll help you. Go to the east to find this man. I shall await do what thou can. Fortunately, I already killed this fool, so let's just give him the thing and move on. My acorn is still gone, so I pray to thee. Hast thou any news for me? No, nothing yet. But I already found then this thing. Continue thy search, I beg of thee. Injustice reigns when thieves run free. Was that bastard that I killed in the last episode? The crazy rambling freak. Well, maybe I killed him and forgot to pick up the acorn. Hold on, I'm, I'm gonna go check that out. Okay, so it appears as though I did in fact not complete that part of the quest already. So, here I am to go and do that. This crazy bastard.
Hold on, you. That's private property. That's an old man's home, that is. Keep out. Keep out. Crazy bastard. I'm reaching in there anyway. You're a robber, is what you are. They sent you, didn't they? Well, I'll show you. They won't get away with this. Of course, he's one of these guys. Let's start killing! damn thing. Do I have to reach back into the thing? I'll do it. Go ahead, boy. Pee on it. I said pee on it. Don't... Ah, whatever. Well, maybe... Hell, I don't know. So be it. Maybe I do have what I need. The guy is dead, so move. go. Heading back to the troop. I wonder... If you look through the backstory, read the codex entries, and find all the books and all that kind of crap, the game goes and talks quite a bit about the different, um, sort of deities and religions and all that kind of stuff that has existed in this game world. But none of them really talk about a gigantic tree that can talk. This tree beard looking motherfucker off in the woods telling me he wants me to go get his unhatched egg back, egg cordon back. So, I don't know, make of that what you will. I know the elves have their own completely separate religion from that of the maker or the Treventor religion of the old gods before them. Oh shit, not expect that. make this species extinct. My acorn is still gone, so I pray to thee. Hast thou any news for me? Ah, uh, is this the acorn you speak? My joy soars to new heights indeed. I am reunited with my seed. As I promised, here it be. I hope its magic pleases thee. Keep this branch of mine with thee, and pass throughout the forest free. I wish thee well, my mortal friend. Thou brought my sadness to an end. May the sunlight find you. Thy days be long, thy winters kind, and thy roots be strong. Level up. 
I should just go back in the direction I came. Now, why did we want this thing's piece of bark? Well, the reason why is because there was a different... There was an area of the forest we were unable to pass through because we're not apparently a tree. It doesn't like us. Like, what are you doing? Trying to get through? Uh-uh, not happening. And just sort of get turned around and sent back to where you came from. But, now that we have the bark, we can pass through without a problem. Hell fruit. Well, I guess that could have gone worse. Okay, the damn game keeps crashing on me. It's driving me nuts. This episode alone, I've had six crashes. Driving all these things together, kind of becoming a bit of a challenge. But hopefully, the worst is behind me. You are not quite as callow as I thought. God that damn it. Unexpected. Did not want to talk to you. I did not want to talk to you. Uh, thanks, I guess. You're welcome. Let's go. As you wish. Didn't want it anyway. On my way. Let's just do this thing. Ah, you again. We are invaded. Intruders have deceived their way into the forest's heart. Fall back to the ruins. Protect the lady. Yeah, yeah, okay. That's right, we're gonna have a dungeon here, aren't we? Ah, oh, jeez, that means I have to end the episode. Alright.